All right, these are my review. I don't know if you can call it a review, but my thoughts on these Nike shoes. These are, <clears throat> I'm not exactly sure what type of shoes they are, like as far as their intention or the reason they were made. I think they're just, um, I mean, I don't know. Shoes that were made for basketball, maybe? Um, I don't, I don't, I don't think so, maybe. I don't know. Here's what they look like there. I didn't buy these shoes. These shoes were given to me by a friend who was given these shoes by his cousin. Um, they're a size too big for me, but uh, they're, they were free, so I'm trying them out. And I'm recording a video about this, so. Um, they have a really high heel. I guess it has a giant pocket of air in the back. So it's a, it's a higher heel than, than I'm used to. Um, I typically buy Vans, uh, shoes since high school. I bought Vans, uh, because I used to skateboard don't anymore but the uh, style kind of stuck I guess I enjoy the old school vans and I enjoy well now just any pair of vans that's kind of like on sale so but uh, when somebody offers me a free pair of shoes I don't I don't turn it down so these are free I said that. I'm not sure the retail price of these things. Um, if I were to go buy them new, Nikes typically aren't super cheap. So I'm, if I were to guess, I would say north of $80. Maybe. Um, I'm a teacher and one of my students saw me wear these and they said that they were the Air Maxes. So I googled Air Max and looked at the Nike website and there's a ton of different Air Max shoes. But they're kind of neat, they're not completely my style and they're a size too big. <laughs> but um, one thing I will comment on is that they're really well built. Uh, like you can tell it's a good quality shoe like I imagine that they're gonna last a long time the guy that uh, gave these shoes away he also had a number of other pairs he was giving away too so it sounds like he might be um, I don't know the termage sneaker geek uh, shoe geek shoe collector I saw on uh, National Geographic that show hosted by Jeff Goldblum that there's even conventions where people collect shoes and they'll play they'll pay a lot of money for a pair of sneakers which I can kind of understand like just being interested in things interested in objects having a fascination I have a fascination with uh, technology, smartphones, um, computers, those sorts of things. So I can get it. Shoes seem a little bit weird though to me because you're going to wear them and they're going to wear out. And if you don't wear them, they're just sitting in your closet kind of rotting. 
decaying. So if you're going to spend hundred dollars, two hundred dollars, three, four, five hundred dollars on a pair of shoes, like get some use out of them, which I'm doing with these. My utility is maximized because I didn't pay for these. Um, they're not completely comfortable. Right here, I can feel it kind of digging into my toe. Um, I imagine that because they seem kind of newish, that when I wear them in a bit more, because it's like a kind of a kind of a really hard leather. Maybe I think it's leather. Maybe as I wear them in, uh, they'll they'll start to they'll start to uh, be better. So, anyways, that's my review thoughts of these Nike shoes. They're kind of neat.